Ciao ragazzi and welcome to this video. This is my first video in English and I'm so excited about it. During these days I had the pleasure to take care of a doggy, Lily, and because of that I was kind of forced to walk her outside and that made me explore where I live as I never did before, even though I've been living for two years here. And so I decided to make a video about it and share with you guys where I live. Seriously guys, walking around I kind of found like very interesting and weird stuff. But that's Birk. That's Birk. Birk is called also the White City and it's situated outside Herning, which is a medium city of Denmark, like with 60,000 inhabitants, in the middle of Jutland, Jutland, which is the peninsula of Denmark connected to Germany on the south. Beer can be also called a student city because there are 300 apartments and all the apartments are for students, so it's basically a campus. As there are two universities, Aarhus University and Via University College or Via College University. Yeah. As it is a student city, there are many activities regarding students during the whole year. For example, there is the student house where every week there are events and parties for students. There is also a small gym and a large field where you can play football or even a beach volley. In front of the Aarhus University there is the Innovatorium, which is a co-working building where small and medium-sized companies can have an office there, as well students with some project or ideas or even a startup can have a free desk in the Innovatorium, which is pretty nice. But Birk is not just that. I want to show you something more. Let's go with it. Yeah, Birk is full of surprises. There are these two open areas. The first one, which is called the Geometric Geo, uh, which is basically the Geometric Garden, and the other one is Kulturparken, which is the Sculpture Park. As you could see, there are many funny paintings, and these paintings were made by Karl Henning Pilsen, which is a famous artist 
Danish artist, which has made most of the paintings that are in Birk. Actually, I think eh, most of them, yeah. And there is a museum dedicated to him uh, and his wife, Carl Henning Pilsen and Else Halfen Museum. There is another museum of contemporary art, which is called the Hart Museum. But art doesn't stop there because there is something else. Elia. Elia is this odd building which looks like an UFO kinda with four columns coming up and very rarely during the year a flame comes up from the middle of this building. I saw it once actually from the university and it was pretty cool like I was oh shit there is fire coming out. And sometimes they even open the inside of it to show it to tourists and uh, curious people. But I've never been there. I would like to go. So this is Birk. A small and quiet place for students in the middle of nature, art and fun, I would say. And even Pokemon Go. Like, I don't know why. Like, there are so many people going around, even during night with cars, with playing Pokemon Go. And yeah, let's leave it. So we'll leave you with the last clips and enjoy your life. <laughs>